Welcome to Langford and the University of Bristol. We're just about to start our third Animal Health and Research Day. The delegates are just entering the room and the day is about to start. One of the key strategic pillars in our business is the work and the progress we've made with regard to improving animal welfare and farm insurance across Europe. We all have a, an individual and almost a collective responsibility in terms of improving farm animal welfare and this fits into one of the motivations for why we organise this day. So we have looked at taking the research work and uh, the research work that we've been doing in sheep in Australia and we've been working very closely with Winterbotham Derby and their supply farms to see if we can uh, get the product also available and useful to use to alleviate pain for piglets undergoing castration. And it's that link which provides the strength. It's not just around, um, around welfare, it's around understanding the needs of the animal and the way the animal thinks as well. It's really thinking about how do we manage these animals to keep them well so they don't need antibiotics. And what was very evident was that animal welfare as a business issue was underreported. My talk was about my PhD research looking at a new system of head-only electrical stunning which we hope will improve welfare and may be acceptable, uh, accepted by the Muslim community. Every presentation has been fascinating and a massive breadth of information across all sorts of fields on animal welfare. Wonderful. I am working in IRTE in Spain in a research institute. I was commissioned to study the consequences of uh, leaving the animals uh, in group. Uh, just after insemination or 28 days after insemination. Uh, this kind of studies are, used, are useful to explain the farmers how to improve animal welfare in their real life, in their real farms. As well as the presentations on the latest trials and research, the day offered a great opportunity to network. Our panel discussion inevitably provoked debate. This year's topic was the business case for animal welfare. It highlighted that the responsibility for improving animal welfare is definitely collective and a complex issue at that. Days such as this can only help further that discussion and contribute to improving animal welfare.